Today's gonna be a busy day. I'm gonna edit all the photos that I took over the weekend. But before I get to that, I gotta start off with my morning routine, always. I'm back, time for a quick shower. Pickup order? Sure, what can I get Can I have the lunch special cauliflower? The time for lunch, Mediterranean food today. All right, thank you. Look at these potato wedges. Okay, and then this is a, a pita pocket. A pita bread with salad and lamb, I think is the meat. Lamb meat. Time to go and start editing these photos. This is a quick look at what editing photos means. So for an hour shoot, which was yesterday, an hour shoot gives me around 360 photos. And then within those 360 photos, there's around 12 to 15 looks. All of these are one look. All of these are one look, all of those is another look. So I have around like 12 to 15 looks. And then so I first go through all the photos and then I pick the ones that are nice. And then afterwards I sort that. Then that comes down to like 15 to 20 photos, and those 15 to 20 photos, I edit each one. It's kind of repetitive, but it's, it's a lot of work. Um, okay, yeah, so back to, back to editing. For dinner tonight, we're cooking curry, and so that means I need to go buy some groceries, and uh, so we're heading over to buy groceries. Good. Sneaky about recording because last time they said I can't record. Successfully recorded inside and got the groceries. This is a tutorial for how to cook curry. You don't need that many ingredients. You just need onions, carrots, chicken thigh this time, not chicken breast, potatoes, and the curry, curry sauce or whatever it is, the curry cubes. First things first. We're gonna throw the onions into the pot to let them start cooking. While the onion cooks, we're gonna chop up the chicken thighs. Cut the chicken into cubes and remove any excess fat. Now we will season it and cook that chicken on the side while throwing more things into the main pot. Once the onions are translucent, you can start putting in the potatoes and then put some water to, just enough to cover the bottom so that way the vegetables don't get burned, they kind of get steamed or like boiled. You can season liberally on the chicken because it's gonna be competing against the curry for flavor so you can make this flavor a little stronger. Then to Cook the chicken, you're gonna turn it on high heat and then wait till the pan's hot so that way you could get kind of a, a little bit of a crust on the chicken. Once the potatoes are nicely well acquainted with uh, the onions, you put in the carrots. The key to making curry is throwing things into the pot. Now we're just gonna pour our little chocolate in there. And then we're gonna constantly stir this in. So as the cubes get melted, the consistency gets thicker. And then when it gets to this point, you grab the chicken and you just dump it in there. That's how you cook curry. It's literally a throw everything in the pot, mix it up, stir it up. Very easy to do. Whenever you need something savory and delicious and all-in-one type of dish, just make curry. It's delicious. Ooh. 
ここ。That concludes today's vlog. Come back tomorrow for another one. Bye. I'm blind so I can't see if anyone's watching me when I do these random videos. <laughs>